everybody, I'm Starlord, and today's video is another update video for Pokemon Brick Bronze. It's been a while since we've actually heard any news, and to be honest, I was going to save this news until further news was actually brought into the whole situation, but I guess no, we haven't had any, and uh, I thought it's about time that I actually catch up those of you who don't have Twitter on what is exactly coming up next for Pokemon Brick Bronze, and when we can possibly see it happening. Uh, so, before we get into the video guys, don't forget to leave a like, and also subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, as it kind of, yeah, you get to see all of our videos, that's pretty cool, right? Yeah, it's pretty neat, cool. Uh, but anyway, today's tweet is from Lando himself, and he actually tweeted this on the 10th of August, that was like 13 days ago, he tweeted that out. So this is pretty old news for those of you who have Twitter, but those of you who don't have Twitter, you know, this is probably news to you. Uh, so first off, the tweet is on screen right here, and it says, Apartments are coming along nicely. We hope to have them done by the end of the month, then focus will be on the 8th gym. And that is pretty much it, but I kind of do want to actually kind of talk about the apartments update. So first off, he then said that they hopefully will be done at the end of this month, which is August. And uh, I really hope it is too, because I know a lot of you guys return back to school in September, which is kind of crappy because, you know, who likes school? Pretty much nobody. Um, but yeah, anyway, if we can get this done by September, that would be absolutely cool. I cannot wait to get my hands on this apartments update. Personally, for me, even though it is a Pokemon game, I do tend to like little things like this added into it. I think when all of this first started getting added into Pokemon was Pokemon Sapphire and Pokemon Ruby. And, um... It was like you were able to like build little houses inside the trees and inside the walls and that was very unique and very cool the way Pokemon or Game Freak actually put that in their game and I'm very happy that Lando and the team have decided to do something kind of similar to this you know where you can actually buy a penthouse or something you get to show off like some kind of cool things in your house uh, but really I kind of wanted to talk about what I would like to see in this update I think would be really cool and make it last a little bit longer because with all of the older updates uh, such as the lottery the arcade they kinda didn't last. I mean, I go into the arcade these days to switch over to my Mega Satellite boards, and I see like one person playing arcade games. Like genuinely no one plays in them anymore because they've kind of forgot to add in content to them. It's kind of like they do something and then they kind of don't uh, continue with it because uh, I heard that when the apartments update was actually brought out, uh, sorry, no, when the when the arcade update was brought out, um, they were going to add in new games, like new little arcade games that you could go back and play, but they just kind of didn't. And I know a game is very hard to create, but uh, yeah, I, I think that they've genuinely kind of just left that out. They're not going to be updating the Lucky Lotto or the arcade anytime soon, which is pretty sad because they were very awesome ideas. It's just nobody really kept at them because they didn't keep updating them, you know? Uh, but anyway, I'm hoping that with the apartments update, you can maybe kind of have like a Pokemon or two roaming around your house. Maybe have some statues of the gyms, like maybe like a gym uh, badge kind of like a little piece of art where you put your gym pins, like after you completed them. Uh, maybe just kind of have a lot of Pokemon nostalgic stuff. Maybe some Pokemon trading cards where you can place them on top of desks and stuff. That would be really cool. I would actually love to see some kind of system in this game where you could buy Pokemon cards and actually like just collect them. That'd be pretty cool too, I think. I know that somebody already tried to make a game of that, but yeah, that just kind of didn't think yo. But either way, anyway, that'd be pretty cool if the Pokemon Brick Bronze devs actually did that, where you could buy Pokemon cards or something and have like your most favorite ones on display in your house for everybody to see. Because it is confirmed that people will be able to actually go inside your house, view it, and there will be uh, there will be houses that you buy with Poke Coins. But then I know there's also something that you can. Uh, buy with Robux. I'm not too sure what that is. Maybe it's like a really expensive awesome apartment or something uh, But we'll find out at the end of this month. Hopefully you never know um 
But yeah, guys, honestly, I am very excited for this update. And of course, then after the eighth gym, I cannot wait for that. Tell me what you feel in the comment section below. Uh, it has been a while since an update in Pokemon Brick Bronze. It really has. And, uh, you know, I can see the players dropping by the month now, uh, which is kind of sad because it is an awesome game. Probably one of the best games on Roblox. Uh, so, yeah, hopefully this will actually bring back a couple of players and hopefully the eighth gym too. I don't know. Get those updates coming out, bros. Come on. Thank you very much for watching today's video, guys. If you're excited for uh, the apartments updates, comment down below. And uh, yeah, until next time, I've been Star Lord. Uh, see ya.